you are screwed we are actually screwed in fact because that is terrifying holy moly Ooh la la ladies and gentlemen she's looking good okay let's see if we can get her let's let's go ahead and open this scroll today we're going to be jumping into the world of primitive era 10,000 bc i have seen this game everywhere and you guys know that we love city builders and strategy games here on the channel so i'm excited to give this game a try and i'm also really excited to let you know that the creators of primitive era have generously sponsored today's video so if you like what you see here in today's video go ahead and give the game a try there's going to be a link down below but also as a gift to all my viewers the developers of primitive era have also given me a gift code so make sure if you do give the game a try use code omniarch to get free in-game rewards with all that out of the way let's just jump right into the game all right looks like we got a cutscene here massive explosion a volcanic eruption okay it's destroying the caves of the primitive people they left their home and embarked on a long migration journey that is tragic with resolve in their hearts they endured cold and starvation that's horrible uh they finally came to this hopeful place okay that looks kind of beautiful I'm not gonna lie to you here a great village is about to be born and rise you already know brother you already know okay so volcanic explosion everyone is uh starving and travels far away from the from the the caves that they come to know and love and she is absolutely gorgeous can we just be honest with each other okay she's gorgeous if this is what cave people look like I I've got a thing for cave people I suppose okay thank goodness we're here wow that chief's hall looks immaculate I don't I mean maybe that's a word you could use uh but where is everyone I don't know man I think they all they just escaped the exploding cave so I, I mean I don't, I, we're gonna have to find out they're probably in the in the woods somewhere okay uncle rudd over here is giga chad he's got an immaculate beard and hair for somebody who lives in the woods that's very impressive i'm heading to the chief's hall to grab some ropes do you want to help me cut down these trees no problem you know i'm an expert in cutting down trees all right so she's handy as well so we're gonna have her go ahead and cut those down and boom we are making progress there we go that was easy peasy one tree down a lot more to go that's that's true there's a whole there's a whole dang forest who's gonna tell her all right so we've cleared some empty space let's go ahead and tap uh the development and we're gonna drop our laborers hut all right this means we just got our first build queue all right this is rustic living ladies and gentlemen this is like camping out in the out in the sticks you know what i'm saying i feel like i feel like we need more of this we need to get back to a more primitive time charcoal kiln all right let's drop it down over here hopefully we don't uh set the forest on fire it'll probably be fine surely surely it'll be fine right uh and now we have charcoal okay that is lit it is literally lit it is uh, illuminated now you can see the fire right there let's go ahead and upgrade this for one gem oh my god that's gonna drive my ocd insane oh no we've run out of meat you are setting me up for a joke that i definitely cannot make but i i will get you some meat chapter two surrounded by dangers so we go from a, a volcanic explosion we finally get our foothold and now it looks like the forest is filled with uh as it turns out dangers can you believe that but uh you know as long as she keeps cutting down these trees we'll make some room a little bunny rabbit just runs away there that's adorable that's also probably dinner to be honest with you uh and we'll collect these berries surely these aren't poisonous berries right yeah the rabbit yes exactly see what great minds think alike I also thought that we should probably kill that rabbit so let's go ahead and do that don't get, go, go go you gotta go quicker than that Meyer okay you are screwed we are actually screwed in fact because that is terrifying true same that's like a YouTube thumbnail right there oh no Myers in danger she needs our help let's build an infantry barracks and send out warriors bro if she's got a bear in front of her right now you do not have time to build an infantry barracks it's too late let's go ahead and get the wooden club infantry we'll speed this up by five minutes boom and there we go all right we're, we're beating them down sorry I put the village in danger you, honestly that was a little bit of a goofball move to be to be honest I mean it's the forest after all screw around and find out you know what I'm saying oh we've got an ancient elder over here this dude's beard braids go so hard hey cheers to you brother yo look at the drip on this lady what is going this yo gladys over here is absolutely dripped out oh man I think they're attacking are we sure that's not Kratos I feel like this is Kratos is this not I'm pretty sure that th that's what this looks like to me oh we got a fortune tellers dome now so we're officially hippies everybody oh the fortune tellers are research okay that actually Actually does that kind of does make sense because we're, we're talking about like primitive people before before technology actually existed okay we rebuilt the hero's lodge and now we can do a free recruit this gentleman right here looks sick so i wonder if we're gonna get him on the first scroll on the first summon okay we got gladys okay i'm pretty that's probably that's probably part of the story honestly you probably get her 
every single time so that that should be expected let's see if we can do another recruit here it says that it says it right there maybe we can do it for free we have a stellar recruit that is free and this looks like we got some magic potions okay we got some ritual do and that's that's all we can do for right now okay we also have a epic recruit and holy moly ooh la la ladies and gentlemen she's looking good okay let's see if we can get her let's let's go ahead and open this scroll come on dude oh okay all right odelia she's a badass she looks like she will murder you i don't know who this is but i'm trying to figure out how i can get my hands on on that type of on that type of hero oh wait you actually get legendary recruitment scrolls just by logging in for the first uh, couple of days so that's actually that's actually huge we're doing a legendary recruit now boys let's see what we get here boom we got panacea yo she's ripped what soul transporter jesus christ she's gonna she's gonna rip your soul out of your body that's actually kind of hot i'm not gonna lie oh we have another epic rec recruit can we please get the really hot girl from the cover that's not even close to the hot girl from the cover bro magic mountain horus he looks like a bouncer at the local club man he's thick but not the kind of thick that we're looking for this is the kind of thick we're looking for man okay einar a little bit of a uh she's a priestess but she looks kind of goth and i'm I, you know you know i'm kind of into that I'm, I'm into that i like that okay let's see if we get uh let's what we get here we got what uh earl your boy earl okay we got <laughs> generic giga chat all right oh we got another free recruit what do we get here oh we got yetta okay cool nice axe bro let's take a look at some of these other heroes here there's a lot of heroes in this game oh my god we got thicket archer the more like thickest archer am i right commanding chief gunjir we have rama gruhan oh my god that's the cutest puppy i've ever seen in my life whole i just want to pet it i don't even care about jiri yet well she's kind of cute too but the puppy carlow he's just holding a chunk of gold okay holy shit, lech brother this looks like he could be in a marvel movie he's literally just completely shredded oh lady of harvest bozena that's that's who we're talking about right there we're looking for bozena yes she is fine we've got veto over here just cooking up the roasted chicken honestly uh, a lot of these different heroes have pretty cool designs but oh we got a whip now okay all right let's take a look at some of the units here in the game obviously we start with the wooden club infantry these are like your tier one units okay uh, and you can upgrade these to stone club infantry so now my boy got a haircut uh and he got some spikes on his baseball bat which is cool next we have the stone axe infantry okay getting a little bit more formidable okay um here we have the wooden shield so an even bigger axe we love to see that uh and then we have the bone shield infantry all right uh oh oh good it gets even bigger turtle shell soldier okay uh we have the tiger hunting warrior my dude is getting jacked whoa horned dinosaur fighter okay we, yo where does this end rhino horn wait how is rhino better than dinosaur wait a minute armed gladiator what is this dude yo he looks like he's something out of an anime that is actually super cool he looks like a demon almost bro if this dude is approaching you on the streets or even scarier in the woods that's his woods okay that's his woods not yours how about those archers obviously we start with the stone thrower then we have the burning stone thrower okay so they just literally light it on fire okay we have the spear thrower okay that makes sense we have the bone spear thrower that's even scarier vine bow archer she's kind of cute i don't know is it just me um we have the bone bow archer the mammoth archer okay now we're getting scary yeah we're getting we're getting the moa archer yeah we're getting real scary okay this is i'm actually getting spooked out what is this buck deer hunter and we have the phoenix feather under what she looks like a golden goddess bro bro she can one shot an elephant no problem no problem she'll cut an elephant in two pieces oh let's take a look at the cavalry now so we start with boar riders this is literally the tier one okay you're riding a literal boar so that's sick we have the gray that's tier two gray wolf rider that looks absolutely sick okay uh now we have a cheetah rider the thunder beast that's what this is probably because when he runs it sounds like thunder that's what i'm you see what i'm doing there the saber tooth tiger rider deodon rider yeah i'm i'm yo black wolf rider and then we have black panther what's this superior thunder beast rider what what the last one's gotta be what a dinosaur superior saber tooth rider bro he looks like a literal like demon think about how big this saber tooth tiger has to be to be to have him on his back this dude looks like he's six five okay uh and this tiger looks like he's as tall as him when he's on his 
four legs We're talking about like a 20 foot long tiger here this is like he can swallow you in in one bite and yo is that the bunny from before did we get him and we get yo attack attack kill it guys I've been playing this game for just a couple of minutes and they already gave me a second builder for free most games make you pay for that either either with gems or with uh you know buying a bundle for dollars not in this game you get two builder huts right off the bat for free oh we just killed that that deer elk moose what was that with pelt our people can dress warmly even in the winter yo we're gonna get even more dripped out and honestly the graphical style I mean the world just looks beautiful I mean it just looks look at the running water okay we've got just like this it's like we're on a tropical island almost uh and we're trying to we're trying to we're trying to make our way in the world you know what I'm saying it's just us against the forest and honestly I, I think that's a little bit more relaxing than some other city builders we've played here on the channel that are just like constant war you know what I mean but the real question is is the music music good the music is good ladies and gentlemen it is just as peaceful and relaxing as I hoped it would be there are beasts and barbarians everywhere outside our village for our own survival there's no other way than to stand our ground and fight what's a megaloceros what's a gold thief bro what oh it's just like a big deer okay that's no problem we can take we can take care of that big old deer no no big deal let's say this is our first fight actually this is the first this first open field brawl right here you can see we're, we're making progress oh I joined the scorpions clan let's go oh you can actually get this dude for free just by logging in for seven days that's actually cool because this guy looks sick he looks like a literal he looks like a lion king I mean like look, look, look at this it's a whole lion head on his on his shoulder and it's it's alive because you can see it's got the the glowing eyes there that's actually sick so down here in the settings this is where you actually can redeem the gift code so you would type in Omniarch here that's where you get your free stuff in case you guys are wondering all right now let's let's zoom out here a little bit it looks like we actually were automatically teleported to where our Alliance Hive is so that's actually really good news that's good for new players because they won't have to think about teleporting to to safety it'll just do it for them automatically which is really good uh and here we can see we're in the open field now and there's a ton of these um barbarians megalocer megaloceros I, I'm probably pronouncing that horribly carved tooth okay that's terrifying and then we have dire wolves which I mean that's just a puppy I just want to pet that thing right there what is a gold thief is this a real thing tell me this is real is this, is this like actually out in the world or are these extinct now because that's that's terrifying oh and you can actually farm rubies here in the open world so the rubies here are the premium currency you obviously can get them by buying bundles but you can also get them for free by just going ahead and gathering them out in the world that's really cool what is this there's a bear right there yo kill him what are you doing kill the bear bro we can't just be having a bear remember what happened last time there was a bear in the city man what are you doing kill it now the foretellers dome this is uh this is the the research in the game so this is what I was talking about before when I was discussing us pretty much being a hippie okay let's go ahead and research some more of the rapid filtration so this looks like this is the economic tree this is your production tree okay then we also have the village development tree okay so this looks like storing materials like resources oh yeah we have stone output okay Okay. then we have the basic battle tree so this is obviously archer promotion cavalry promotion okay so yeah this is this is your military stuff right here that makes sense then we have moderate battle okay so we, as you progress throughout the game you unlock new trees here within the research uh and then we have march queue infantry promotion archer promotion and cavalry promotion interesting stuff here oh you get five legendary recruitment scrolls if you bind your account which you always want to do by the way because that's going to just basically save your progress man we're making progress on our little city here we cleared a lot of land in one video that's actually pretty that's pretty good but for now that is going to do it for today's video if you enjoyed the video make sure you drop a thumbs up on it it really helps out the channel a ton it helps get this video out there into the YouTube algorithm so other primitive era players might see it I I do want to thank primitive era 10,000 BC for sponsoring today's video once again generous sponsors like primitive era help me do what I do here on YouTube so if you want to support the channel and also give a new free game a try go ahead and click the link down below to download primitive era today it's free to start playing so you might as well give it a try while you're down there make sure you subscribe to the channel and click the bell to be notified the next time that I upload a video and finally comment down below your thoughts on primitive era with that being said guys thank you so much for watching this has been Omniarch I will talk to you guys again soon peace